Welcome Warframe and that's right my name is WildHammer99 and today we're here to talk about the Detect or Marabella is what I named my Zor. It is really really nice really it's a great build and I think this uh, uh, Detect needs a bit more love than what it's actually given. I see a lot of YouTubes on all the other great Zors like the Kepler um, and all the other ones which are really great builds, don't get me wrong. But I think this one has, hasn't has deserved its respect. Now, I think it's due and it's time. Now, we're just going to show you here in the testing facility. I'm on a frame which doesn't have anything. We've just got 130 heavy gunners here. And when we start mashing into it and start building these props up, as you can see, everything just dies. So once we start getting our combo up, well, that wasn't meant to happen. And as you can see, 130 gunners or 130 gunners, you guys aren't going to get to in a hurry. So if we can smash these out, look at all those red crits, it is absolutely insane. Now, we can literally get behind this guy, smack him out, and we're done. Now, this is my choice of frame that I use all the time for my Mirabella build, as you can see here. But if you want to go just that little bit of extra insaneness, you want to jump on your Mirage Prime with a decent build, load him back in, and it absolutely goes crazy. So let's show you. Again, 130 heavy gunners. And once you start building those stacks up, they just get deleted. <laughs> and it doesn't matter where you've gone, I've literally got in an arbitration with this. And it nukes, even without this. Once you start building your combo counter up, it's absolutely insane. So, without any further ado, let's show you the build. Righty, so we're here with the build, and this is how I win it. Yes, I do have a Riven, but that's the whole point why I'm getting some numbers. Yeah, I could change a few things and probably make this a little better, but I'm going to let you guys let me know down in the comments below of what you think. So we're going to start off with a bit of Prime Pressure Point. Normally, some Broad Rush, because we are building a crit build, some Berserker, Contacting, uh, drifting contact, just to get a little bit more range, we're using prime reach, you can use the normal reach, just to let you know if you see a prime card here, just use the normal version of this, it still works wonderful. Uh, we're going to use uh, shocking touch, prime fever strike. And my Detet Riven, which is, I think, a really nice roll for what I got. I've only done eight rolls, yes, I could probably do better. But I like the extra uh, Toxin and Electric that I get from this with the melee damage. So that's why. So in actual case, we end up with Corrosive at uh, 1,292. We still stay at the range at 32. Uh, critical chance and the rest of our numbers are absolutely awesome here this is the other one that I'm using I can't pronounce it so I do apologize and we're not even using an arcane but if you guys do not have a nice ribbon just to prove to you guys we're going to change over here and this is what I've changed it to obviously we're still keeping this and everything else the way it is. The only thing we've really changed is I'm not using my Riven and I've gone for True Steel which actually brings my critical up to 51.2%. Now if you guys are like, oh but is it doing the same damage? Well let me prove it to you. We're going to use our Mirage like we just did. We're going to spawn these guys in Back to our Mirage, and and as you can see, everything just gets deleted as soon as you bring up your combo counter. 
and it didn't last long. Willingly, the damage has dropped a little bit, but it is still correctly absolutely insane. Now, you don't have to use Mirage. I can do the exact same on my other build. It's just that this is what I was on at the time. So, let me know what you guys think. That's a quick breakdown of my weapon. I will show you the parts right here, just to let you see them. So, if you need to build it, obviously it's the tent. I am using this, but you can use any grip you like. But, I would get away with using um, my link right here but it's your choice i think if people sort of come back with a li little bit more of a damage build because i actually went for a little bit more of attack speed because i like a fast saw i don't like a slow saw i think this build rivals the rest of the saws quite nicely and i think it just needs a bit of love so other than that thank you very very much for watching from wild hammer 99's point of view with the detet or marabella as my saw is called and we'll see you next time with another video from Wild Hammett 99.